Hey guys, Nary here with another episode of Doom Eternal. It's pretty early in the morning. I've got my cup of coffee. I'm ready to make another video for you guys. We're gonna get through this game pretty quickly. Or maybe it's a it's a pretty damn long game, but we're gonna I'm gonna try and I'm gonna try and make uh, whenever I do an episode, I'm gonna try and release an episode of Doom Eternal and an episode of one of my other series. So we can get through this pretty quickly. Anyway, guys, I hope you are ready. I see I'm rocking my crimson armor and I've got the uh, the den stage right here. So if you guys are ready, let us jump right back in. Oh, I just love how fast that loads. 99%. There we go. Right back in, ladies and gents. Let's get to it. Let's get cracking. Nice. All right. Formation of the Ark. Ooh, that's pretty cool. Following the total collapse of international civilization, nations and boundaries as we know them have ceased to exist. A handful of remaining bureaucrats, government officials, and military leaders have managed to survive by use of protective bunkers kept secret to the greater population. Convening under the flag of the Allied Nations, this governing body represents all that remains of the rule of law, forming what would essentially become a single world government. Military bases in communication with the AN have made efforts to regroup and centralize their areas of command, establishing fortified safe havens for survivors, stockpiling food and scavenging for supplies. Only proprietary military use communications remain functional, enabling military entities under command of the Allied Nations to coordinate in humanitarian aid and defense operations. By 2151, the formation of the Ark has taken highest priority and is considered to be, in all practical terms, the last hope for humanity. Yeah, no kidding. Ah, uh, yeah, we're gonna... Hit with that. Tentacles, I hate these things. The subject of great, of great scrutiny for Ark scientists on Earth, these hell-growth formations have appeared all over the planet, taking hold wherever hell has made its presence known. Forming chaotic, seemingly random structural patterns, the propagation of hell growth has taken root at an alarming rate, exhibiting a cellular reproduction cycle that Ark scientists fear may become impossible to contain. The resultant environmental effect is extremely hostile to terrestrial life, producing atmospheric biocontagions and a multitude of organic hazards. Wherever these nest-like formations emerge, they are protected by swaths of defensive tendrils, long thorn tentacles that demonstrate keen awareness of their surroundings, fully capable of disemboweling anything that, deems, that it deems to be a potential threat to the nest. Yep. Nope. Take that, bitch. Secret around here. Yes, there is. I gotta. Yeah, it's gonna be over there. Yeah. Okay, where's that secret at? Yeah, shotgun's best. We got oh yeah the infinite lives one that's pretty good we're not going to be using any cheats on our playthrough though so ah yes here we go again whoa yeah caca demons do a lot <laughs> Kaka demons do a lot of damage with the challenges. Mission. No challenges right now. Okay. Oh, in the face! Yes! <laughs> this is how my mornings start! Anything? Nope, we good. We go. Okay, crazy armored spider. Oh, sorry, buddy. Oh. 
Get out of here! Oh! Never seen that one before. You're going down. Come on! I need some health! Damn, this is getting crazy. Come on. Come on, come back here. Nice. I'm in the zone. Auto zone. Scream for me, my meat pinata! Alrighty, now oh, that was crazy. Okay. Let's see. Uh, I got plenty of. Well, I don't have plenty of ammo, that's for damn sure. I run out almost constantly. Ah, I just love watching them explode. Ah, there's something wrong with me. But there's something wrong with all of us. Let's be broken inside together. There we go, got two extra lives. Honestly, this is, to me, this is one of the greatest FPS games ever made. Oh shit. Let's do it! Ow! Where are you at? Oh! Hey, you like me now, Jerry? Yeah, you guys are getting called Jerry from now on. Fuck you, Jerry. Oh! And yeah, there is actually a lot of infighting amongst them, but they never kill each other, so... It's okay now. Who's ready for it? Ow! Damn! Oh! Yep, it is a... There we go!
got that. <laughs> oh, I love the sound that makes. If any of you guys are looking for a really good brand of coffee, San Francisco Bay is absolutely fantastic. Alright, this is about the end of the level. The gathering of health priests is located just above your location. My scans indicate there is a lift at the center of this facility. Ah, oh, man, that is metal as hell. Fuck, I love this game. Keep singing, guys. Keep singing. I'm just checking my map. This is so damn cool. Fast travel. Alright. Let's do it. Ah, uh, what a barge city. Uh, there we go. And it's just about instant, too, which is pretty insane. Okay, so it's up there. Yep, so that is how fast travel works, guys. Doomslayer is such a nerd! I love it! Alright, sit it down. Alright. Diagnilux. One of the. Th okay. Uh, that's what he was before he got corrupted. So. One of the three Hell Priests, Diagnilix is charged with ensuring that Hell's invasion of Earth succeeds. He prefers to operate on the planet's surface, working on in his unholy barge carried on the back of a demonic titan. This provides him an elevated mobile position with which to oversee the campaign against humanity. Spiteful and cruel, Nilix frequently captures civilians alive so that their still living blood can be harvested for his occult rituals. Yeah. Yeah, I think it's about time we, uh... Put this motherfucker out of our misery. We got one more to grab. Hell priests. Powerful practitioners of arcane magics, the priests have warped their powers to suit their insidious purpose, harnessing the dark forces of hellish psychomancy to prepare Earth for the final blood ritual. By, blo by blood were the hell priests bound to the dark ritual which now consumed Earth, and so long as even one of them lives, the consumption of Earth would continue, allowing hell, allowing hell unfettered rule of the mortal world. Only by destroying the priests can the blood ritual be stopped and the Earth be saved. Man, the environmental and level design is top fucking notch. The con maker is present at this gathering, but when outside of her domain, she is by all accounts indestructible. Oh, I've uh, heard that before. Nothing! The sacrament of this world. 
to the great Khan Maker will be made. And the energy will be restored once again. As it is written, from the souls of the non-believers, you will not save them from their judgment. Pocket sand! You go too far this time. You cannot interfere. This is humanity's chance to repent. To give service to us. You cannot resist the will of the card maker. Activating the portal now. For it was seen. Who was meant to enforce it? All right, guys, that's going to wrap up this Let's Play. You know, after I, uh, hell yeah. All right, we'll save and exit. All right, guys, that'll about wrap it up for another Let's Play episode of Doom Eternal. I'm going to be coming out with a lot more of these quickly. I, I really want to get through this game and show you guys everything it has to offer because it is honestly one of the best first-person shooters I've ever played. It is, and it is going to be a classic for decades to come. And I hope other games try and copy this formula because it is a winning formula, and I would love to see more games like Doom. <clears throat> There's also another, uh, another game coming out lately. It's uh, like it's inspired by Doom and Quake. Let me uh, let me look up the name real quick. Give me a second, guys. Let me see if I can find the name of this game. It uh, it's been getting high praise from people who've played it. Uh, uh, okay, I guess it's not on this list. Okay, um. Tell you what, next video I'll let you guys know what it is. <laughs> but anyway guys, thanks for so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and ring that little notification bell. And until the next video, I love you all. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.